In Rochester today, the jury trial began for a woman accused of hitting and killing three siblings as they boarded a school bus last year. Jury selection took place yesterday. Six men and six women will decide the fate of Alyssa Shepard. She faces three charges of reckless homicide, criminal recklessness, and passing a school bus with its stop arm extended. Shepard says she didn't recognize the flashing lights on the bus until it was too late to avoid the children. She faces up to 21 years in prison if convicted on all charges. A witness who was in a trailing car behind Shepard testified this morning, as did the mother of the children who died. Neighbors we spoke to say they feel bad for both families involved. It's a tough time, and they have to relive all of this again, right? This is a horrible time. And, you know, the, the court trial just happens to fall right a week or so before the anniversary of this tragedy. So there's a rough couple weeks ahead for us, and there's a lot of emotion. I, I pray for both sides of the family. I feel very empathetic for the kids, their parents, what they've gone through, and her family too. I mean, this is, it affects so many people, not just who's on trial. So, yeah, I feel bad for everybody. Now, since that tragedy, state lawmakers have toughened the rules and penalties that govern drivers around school buses. Our Jeff Newmeyer has been in that courtroom this morning following this case closely. He'll have the latest developments for you in his reports tonight at 5 and 6 right here on ABC 21.